is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is which planets have volcanoes under surface. So uh, volcanoes are a terrestrial landform. So the terrestrial planets that are the candidates for having volcanoes is Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. And it happens that they all have volcanoes. And I will separate them into two categories, active and non-active. So for the active volcanoes, we have Earth, and we have Venus. The reason that they're active is because Venus and Earth are large enough to retain the heat from formation and it causes the planet to still be active. So this, the bigger the planet, the more likely that it is still active uh, inside. If the planet has lost all its heat, it's considered non-active. So the non-active, and this is due to their small size, is Mars and Mercury. Now, for Mercury, uh, the volcanoes look sort of like a small crater impacts rather than the, the large typical volcano that we have in mind, that we have here on Earth. Uh, for Venus, uh, it actually has a lot of volcanoes and is about a 1,600 uh, major volcanoes. But the reason we don't have a really good count of this is because observing the surface of Venus is uh, uh, actually quite difficult because the, the atmosphere is so thick and opaque so it becomes very difficult to do terrestrial observations of Venus. Uh, here on Earth we have the large shields, the cone volcanoes, we have a broad variety of active volcanoes. And finally Mars, Mars has one of the largest volcanoes in the solar system and is very famous, it's called Olympus Mons. And Mars actually has three regions that are famously known for volcanic uh, landforms, and is Tharsis, Elysium, and Hellas. And this is some of the information of the volcanoes that we can find here in the solar system. My name is Eileen Perez, and these are the volcanoes that have, these are the planets that have volcanoes here on the solar system.